Exercise 14, Changing Background in Slide Master View, part of the PowerPoint 2007 Exam Prep Guide, brought to you by ShiftKey Solutions. In this exercise, we're going to be talking about changing the background of a slideshow using the Slide Master View. So here we have our gaming presentation slideshow open, and the first thing we want to do is rename this presentation the same way we would do any presentation that we open for the first time and that we plan on making changes to. This way we have the original file available for us if later on we decide we want to scratch the whole thing and start fresh. So we're going to come here to our office button. We're going to go to save as PowerPoint presentation and then we're going to navigate to our student files folder which is inside of our student data files folder on our desktop. I'm going to put my first and last name in the name that's already there. And then I'm going to click Save. Now at a glance I can look at my title bar and see that my name is truly at the end of my file name. Next I'm going to come to my View tab and then in my Presentation Views I'm going to click Slide Master. Next, I'm going to come to my background group and click background styles. And then at the bottom down here, I'm going to click format background. That will open up my format background dialog box tab. I'm going to come over to the picture and texture fill and then come down to insert from and click my file button. Next, I'm going to navigate to my student files PowerPoint 2007 folder and find the controller image here. I'm going to click on this one time and then click insert. And when I do I can see my live preview in the background. Well this would be too dark for all of my slides so I want to change the transparency and make it somewhat of a watermark to the back. So I want to change this to 95 percent. I can grab my slide bar here and move it over to the right until I get to it or I can click inside here and type in 95 percent. And here in my live preview I can see that that's a better depiction of my background. When I'm finished I'm going to click apply to all. And then if I look over in my slides pane I can see that all of my, my master slide and all of the slide layouts now have this applied to the background. From here I'm going to click close and then I'm going to close my master view and there we have it. I can see here on my title slide that it is truly in the background in a subtle effect. So I'm going to save my work here in my quick access toolbar. And that's it. That concludes exercise 14, changing background in slide master view. Next will be exercise 15, enter and move text.